Hello viewers, I welcome you all to Technology Learning Space YouTube channel. In this video, you are going to watch how to upgrade vSphere VMware EXSI host from 5.5 to 6.5. vSphere offers different methods to upgrade EXSI host. You can upgrade using Update Manager or vSphere Auto Deploy or Scripted Upgrade. Otherwise, you can use a direct ISO image to upgrade your EXSI host. So depends upon your environment, you can adopt one of the mentioned method to execute EXSI upgrade. Scope of this video is to cover EXSI upgrade using a direct EXSI ISO image. So in this method, you are directly mounting your ISO image to a physical host. This can be through a CD or USB or you can use a virtual media like ID rack. So this deployment need your attention to each machine. So this is practical only if you have lesser number of uh, EXSI host. In case of a large environment, you need to go for auto deploy or upgrade manager. Installation of this method is very similar to fresh installation. Upgrade wizard will allow you to keep a VMFS data store and you can upgrade the EXSI host alone. Here are some of the key points need to be checked before you proceed to upgrade. Check and confirm your plugins installed and other VMware solution compatibility with the EXSI version that you are going to upgrade. And it is recommended to detach fiber channel connections but this is not mandatory, even you can do it on fly. Make sure you have a proper backup to revert backup in case of any failure. You need to power off or you have to choose to migrate all virtual machine to another host during the upgrade. Now let us see a demo on how to upgrade EXSI host from 5.1 to 6.5. Here the EXSI host uh, 192.168.1.120 uh, is the one which we are going to upgrade uh, from 5.1 to uh, 6.5. So the first step is to shut down or migrate all the virtual machines and then um, we can proceed to upgrade the uh, EXSI host. Next step is to connect or mount the ISO image. This can be done through a USB or a CD. Now power up the machine. Okay, once you have the boot menu, you can manually select uh, CD-ROM or whatever the boot, uh, the disk, uh, the method you are using. You can see it's a VMware EXSI 6.5.0. So the installation is in progress. Press enter to continue. Accept and continue by pressing F11. Now you can see the local disk is uh, showing here uh, 40 GB capacity. Uh, it contain a VMFS uh, partition. Press enter to continue. Here you have two options. You can install and preserve VMFS data store. As it is an upgrade, I prefer the first option. Uh, preserve uh, VMFS data store. This way the virtual machine will stay inside the data store. Um, US default, uh, press enter and you can create a new password for uh, EXSI host. Press F11 to kick off the installation. Okay, the installation is completed. You can remove the media and reboot your server. Now, uh, once the system is ready, you can uh, try to connect it uh, to vSphere client. The old client which you were using like vSphere uh, client is not going to work with uh, vSphere EXSI 6.5. So to connect uh, this EXSI host you need a web client. And this is embedded with uh, EXSI host so you can browse uh, from uh, Mozilla Firefox or any other explorer.
so everything is fine here now you can uh, start up your virtual machine which you shut down or you can rebalance uh, by using live motion to bring back your virtual machines so that's all thanks for watching this video 